And welcome back to Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade. Oh my god, it's almost midnight. I think it's time for bed. Also, how much money did we make today? Oh wait! We got ourselves a little event. Pretty sure this is actually randomly triggered. I've never gotten it to uh, trigger like under my control. So, guess it's a good thing I did, didn't did start until after uh, before I went to bed. I can talk. Oh. Well, you have me. Yeah, actually no, I think this happens every time after you restore a bell. But we should probably figure this out. Uh I would say initiative. But yeah, actually, no, now that I think about it, I think that happens every time, like, after you restore a bell. Also, we made no money today. Oh, well. But anyways, we're gonna need to get into that field at some point. And that means growing a lot of lettuce. About? Um... A bit late for that, but okay, fine. I I know I know how this works. It's been like a week already. But yeah, like always, crops die when seasons change. I can ugh. Yeah, I don't know why they decide to give you this like this late, but yes I understand. Don't tell me anymore. Especially since it's only day ten. Also, are they holidays coming up? Oh, wait. Alright, Flower Festival on Saturday? Uh, yeah, Saturday. Okay. But yeah, I don't know why they wait until now to tell you that stuff. Oh, well. Also, what's my inventory looking like? Uh, let's make some more tea. And I'll save the green herb for later. Alright, let's head out. Now then, everything should be planted. Ooh, wait, we got mail. Yep, basically now that we restored the red bell, blacksmith works again. We're gonna need to- actually we could refine ore, except I can't afford it right now, so never mind. Oh wait, cabbage. Uh, I don't have any more seeds, do I? No. Oh well. Uh, we'll have to give that away. We can sell that one. Alright, that's all that's ready today. I'll get everything watered in a second. Right now, though, I'm gonna go grab all my animals and make sure they're okay. And by grab them, I mean just go make sure they have their love for the day. Uh, still n no one's grown up. Oh well. Alright. You two, go ahead and eat. You'll get big eventually. Emily's gonna get big soon, I think. Nina is gonna take a while, but we're not in any real hurry for her. That being said, it's good to get them to love you early on. Makes it easier. Also, why I've been feeding them by hand instead of just letting them graze outside? Uh, I'm not sure if I've said it yet, but basically that makes them love you more. Animals like it better when you feed them by hand. Which makes sense. Also, I forget, do I have the incubator already? Uh, yes I do. So once Karen grows up, we'll pretty much be good on chickens. Although at some point I do want to buy a duck. Ducks don't produce as many eggs, but I think the eggs are worth slightly more and you need one for a quest later on. So I might as well grab a duck egg when I can. Although yeah, we don't need to buy any more like livestock. We can just put the eggs in the incubator. But for now, before we let everyone out, let's make sure everything's watered. Because they don't like it if I accidentally water them. And I tend to do that. 
because they love to wander on my fields. Also, I would upgrade this thing, but I can't afford it right now. We'll upgrade it later. Uh, looks like we're not going to get any real money until everything starts maturing. Although once everything does mature, we're going to get a huge amount of cash. Unless it's, uh, what is it? Lettuce. If it's good lettuce, we can't sell it. We got to give it away. Also, we really don't have much to do today. Well, we're going to go to Flute Fields real quick just to drop off the lettuce. Uh, we can't really buy anything right now. For obvious reasons. Oh, wait. Is that ready? Nope. I thought it was. Also, picking weeds gives uh, takes away more stamina than using the sickle. I don't know why. Well, I guess it would be harder. So let's just get everything watered. Once all this grows, we're going to make so much money. And then probably spend it all, like, right away. Kind of regretting that I bought a sheep so early on, but oh well. Earlier we buy her, the better. It's better in the long run. There we go. Oh, that reminds me, we need to get the key to a uh, Fugue Force at some point. We might as well do that today. We'll head over to the mining area t uh, a bit later. Right now, though, might as well go to the flute fields. But first, I'm going to drop off what I can sell. So... Uh, I can sell that. I need to keep that. And I can sell the decent one. Okay, we're good. Wow, I am completely out of gifts. If I see any more herbs, I have to go grab them. Although blueberries would be good too, but apparently there aren't any around today. I guess I kind of cleaned out the fields pretty early, so nothing's respawned yet. Oh well. It's not like we need to give anything away right away. I do have my other Wiimote, so we can just rub people to make them love us. Alright, let's just get to Marimba Farm. Uh, I don't even remember how many more lettuce I need to give her. I think I need six more, I want to say. On the other hand, once we're done with that, we can just sell everything we have. And lettuce sells for a pretty good amount. Actually, now that I think about it, I probably should have gone to the mining district first so I could grab the axe. Or I could grab the, uh, what is it, key and then just come back here. Oh well. A bit of extra travel time never hurt anyone. Plus, time moves pretty slowly in this game compared to other ones. Wait, are you guys even open yet? Nope. Well then. I've made a huge mistake. Not really, we just have to kill in like 20 minutes. You know, we can totally just hop the fence. But nope. Actually, wait, she might be at her house. Let's see. No, they're not gonna let me in. Alright. Uh, ten more minutes. Can I just go in now? Nope. Alright, they should be open, like, about now. There we go. They open at exactly eight. Alright, Ruth. Uh, where's the lettuce? There it is. How many more do I have to give you, anyways? Uh, I need to give her four more. Okay. That's not too bad. Also, while I'm here, hold still. Uh, one sec. I don't think the sensor bar is working. Okay, one second. Alright, it's working again. So, let's get a bit of affection from her. No, come on. Give me the hearts. There we go. Alright, what was I doing? Oh, right. Going to the mine district, because we need the key to the forest. But we don't need it. We might as well grab it today and just go in tomorrow, I guess. We're not in any huge need for wood right away. Uh, right now there are other things to come before upgrading our house and buildings. Mostly buy more equipment. 
And by equipment, I mean furniture. Also, I saw an herb here. There's one. Alright, off to the mines. Uh, we probably should, should have gone seeing the others, but oh well. Let's see, is there anything else I need to do today? Today's gonna be a pretty chill day now that I think about it. Mostly because I don't have money to spend, so I don't really need to go anywhere. And making time pass would probably be best. Maybe getting wood wouldn't be such a bad thing. Oh well, I'll figure it out later. I could go mining, but I don't think I have my hammer with me. Nope. And I don't really feel like going to get it. Maybe we'll see the Harvest Goddess while we're up there. Maybe she'll have something to do. Not really. Uh, but are there any more herbs in the area? I do need to make more tea. Let's see... Also, I didn't pet- oh wait, there's some. Or er, there's one. You know what? On the other hand, yeah, we should probably use up our energy before we go to bed. So we'll head over to the forest later. The forest is interesting. And by interesting, I mean it's not really a maze, no matter what anyone says. It's literally just uh, run through until you reach the end. But anyways, let's just go get the key. It's at the Carpenters, I believe. While we're there, we might as well get an estimate on our house. Because I don't remember exactly how much wood we need. I think it's like... 40 pieces, I want to say? Well, one way to find out. Also, I just realized I still have mushrooms on me. I should start giving those away. Only problem is I don't remember who likes mushrooms. Oh well, it's a good neutral gift. Oh wait, I just realized. Uh, what day is the mine closed? Thursday, okay good. Oh wait, I see an herb. And bears, but the bears aren't important. Hey mama bear. Actually, no, I don't feel like robbing her today. Or her cub. Instead, let's go get that key. Hey Dale, do you have the key to Fugue Forest? I kinda need it. Um, okay. I need key. Give me key. There. Simple enough. Yeah, no, it's not even remotely dangerous. Well, maybe... Actually, wait. If he went in there and you have the key, how did... Did you lock him in? Well, that was easy. But yeah, we should probably go find him. Considering that place has been locked for like a week. So yeah. Luke is missing in the forest. And by missing, I mean he's probably waiting in there and can't get out. Because we kind of lock... The only entrance in and out is kind of locked right now. Oh well. But yeah, let's head over to the... I almost said the mine. The forest. Uh, but I'm gonna need to go grab my axe beforehand. The game won't actually let you in without your axe. Mostly because it's actually randomly generated, and it's completely possible to get stuck there without an axe. Because sometimes trees will get in the way. Although, if you don't have the stamina, I suppose one other way to get out would be, like, just using your axe until you faint. That usually gets you out of a lot of situations, actually. But yeah, they just don't want you to get permanently stuck there. So we have to stop by the farmhouse real quick. Uh, I want to brew up some tea. And then, actually, I'm going to take a stop at the hot tub. Okay, technically it's a hot spring, but still. I could use a stamina to chop down some trees, because 
tree cutting is kind of hard work. So, let's go grab our axe, uh, make some tea, and get going. Although... Oh, right, I forgot. I still have some failure in here. Uh, where is it? Also, why am I still carrying the bell with me? I don't need that right now. I do want to bring my sickle to start cutting some grass. Everything else can stay. Because cutting wood doesn't take up inventory slots. I think. Oh, nope. Why did I exit out of that? Let's just convert all our herbs to uh, tea. Except for the green one. We need the green one. And strangely enough, I don't think the green herb makes green tea. Oh, nope. You can make green tea, though, but it requires, like, tea leaves. Which, I guess, makes sense. Let's see, we still have two more, right? Here, I'll just convert one and then save one for later. I'll convert the last one, like, off-screen or something. But anyways, I have my axe. Uh, what is it? Let's see. And my sickle, because I want to cut down some grass. Then we'll stop by the hot tub and then head to the forest. Sounds like a plan. Alright, uh, so sickle. Where is it? There it is. Let's get down some grass. And get some free fodder out of it. I don't think you can cut down the half-eaten ones, though. Those have to grow fully back before you can cut them. Also, we might as well cut down some weeds. Just be careful not to cut down any crops. They tend not to like that. By not like that, I mean they will die. And then you can't harvest them for money. And money is kind of important. Also, where are our clothes? Unless we were wearing them inside the hot tub. Which I could see in this game. I mean, it's so innocent, you never know. Although that would be kind of horrible to move around with, considering I'm, like, wearing leather. Actually, no, I don't think that's leather. It looks like suede, I would say. I'm not really sure what my jacket's made out of. Oh, speaking of jackets, I do want to buy some new clothes at some point. Uh, once I actually make some money. Actually, what's my next big purchase going to be? Probably a television. It'll be good to know the weather. Let's see, a TV would be good, uh, I suppose a duckling. And then, yeah, I think some clothes would be nice. Also, at some point, we should probably pay back the mayor. But we'll need 5,000 gold to do that, so that'll take a while. Also, an oven would be nice. And a house upgrade. Actually, no, we're gonna need a lot of things. But the first thing I want to buy is a television. Alright, let's head over. Actually, wait, I do have the key with me, right? I didn't accidentally put it away. Nope, there it is. Good. Alright, let's get into the forest now. Hey, squirrel. Actually, wait. Hold still, squirrel. I want... Oh, right. Wemo turned off. There it is. Actually, you know what? Let's just rub people as we pass by. Come on. No, come on. There we go. Love. Oh no, put that away. Don't give it to the boar. Actually, I wonder. Can I get Renee from this range? No, gotta move close. There we go. I'm at maximum range. It's kind of weird to rub her at this range though, because she's so small. Come on. There we go. Also, I could rub her father, but no, we're not. In oh wait, no, we are in range. Wow, this thing has pretty far reach. Uh, it gets kind of weird at longer range, though, just because they're so tiny. And the actual point of rubbing is kind of imprecise. He'll love me eventually. He's a really... Come on. There we go. Uh, I could go talk to him, but nah. Alright, anyways, let's stop getting distracted and get into the forest.
Also, not really sure why they use the mine background for the title of the area. Oh well. Anyways, let's use the key. And with that, gate should be open. Wait, oh wait, that's right. I forgot they also make you bring a hammer. Alright, fine. You know what, we'll go there tomorrow. And I think I'll end the episode here, so... Not really much ha really happened today. We unlocked Fuke Forest, but we can't go in because the game won't let me in without a hammer. Which I completely forgot about. I knew, I knew it didn't let you in without an axe. Oh well. So, next time on Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade, we're gonna go lumberjacking. So, till then.